Yo, what's up YouTube? I'm back again with another video. Uh, guys, this time, uh, this is on a men's cologne. This is called OK Wow. It's preferred version of CK Shock. And uh, let me tell you, man, this is a great scent. Great projection, great longevity. And basically what this smells like, to me, uh, you get hints of the tobacco. You get, it's kind of sweet like, you know, when you first initial blast of this stuff, it's really sweet. And then again, it changes, kind of settle down. It's like I get hints of vanilla up in here, but it mostly it's, it's, it's more like the tobacco, you know, it's sweet. Then I guess that's when the vanilla come to play. But it's more like a sweet vanilla. But let you guys check out the spray on this one. It's what the ball like close view right here. Okay, number wow. Whoa, or whatever how you pronounce that. Okay. Alright. Check out the sprayer, guys. Pretty decent sprayer. And uh, like I said, this stuff smells really good. And uh it's got more like a sweet tobacco vanilla that's what i get um like i said it's beast projection the longevity of it's good too anywhere from eight to ten hours or longer it depends man like i always tell you guys i i hit my collar right across here when i spray my colognes man i'm show you guys how i do it when i spray my colognes i hit my collar right across here like that then I go down with it a little ways and because your clothes carry the scent a whole lot longer than your skin will see right around here where your heat generate at around your neck and stuff like that that smell gonna really radiate from right around this collar of this shirt like that and on down to up in here to your chest area I always go down with the cologne up in here too so that smell just keep on radiating right off your own body, you know. But anyway, yeah, guys, what it smells like to me, it's more like a sweet vanilla. And then it changes to get the tobacco. <sighs> you can say it's sweet vanilla tobacco. Then it's like, just turn it like more of a sweetness to it. But to me, it reminds me a little bit. Just a little bit. It reminds me of Juke Holmes. I know you guys know that for Juke 1989, the first the, the uh, pink purple looking juice, the pink Juke. It reminds me of that. That's a little bit with the sweetness to it. It's kind of candy sweet. No, that's how sweet this stuff is. Uh, the box looked pretty cool. As you can see the box close view. The base of the bottle is on the box. You know, right there. What it look like in the back. It's got preferred to the top. And uh, you can get this from offline anywhere from 10, 12, 15 bucks. You know, I ordered mine off eBay. I think it was 10 99 something like that. But uh, yeah, this is good. It projects and it really lasts a great deal, man. It lasts a long time. And it's smooth. I get the tobacco, you get hints of the the, uh, the vanilla. It's just a smooth scent, guys. If you like CK1 Shop, uh, it's, this is the version of CK1 Shop with the smooth tobacco, vanilla type smell. This is it. And, you know, it's always something. This cologne can remind you of another cologne. Or that cologne there can remind you of another cologne here. It was always like that, you know what I'm saying? Like, like this here remind me a little bit of jupe. With the sweetness of this, kind of reminds me of jupe too. But where it's not exactly like the jupe because of the, the tobacco smell that's in this, it's got like a great smooth kind of vanilla tobacco type smell. And uh, this is definitely, I would say this would be more of a fall scent. This would be uh, like a heavy fall winter scent. Because this cologne really lasts a great deal. I'm telling you, it lasts. So, that's one of the main reasons I wouldn't wear this. 
no, during the summer, spring months, because uh, I think this will be a little bit too heavy for that. That being said, you know, it's better for fall and winter, because this, this cologne is kind of like dark. It's kind of tobacco, smoky, sweet, vanilla. It's, a, it's an amazing scent, though. But like I said, I think, in my opinion, that's might, might be just my opinion, this would be a little bit too heavy to wear during the spring and the summer months, you know. Because this, uh, you know, during those months like that, this particular cologne probably could get cloned. And um, that's something you really wouldn't want to, you know, close yourself out with it. You know, because it keep on projecting and projecting and projecting. And the longevity carries on, like I said, it went for 8 to 10 hours or longer. It depends if you hit your clothes across here and stuff like that. Or hit your arm folds up in here. It probably carry on even longer. So, in the summer heat, it probably will last for the next day. It's got good sillage on this stuff. For it to be made by preferred. As you can see right there, preferred fragrance. And, uh, yeah, this one here, it's got pretty good sillage on it. So, that being said, you know, I, I would... Definitely highly recommend you wearing this during the fall winter months because this stuff can get sickly sweet with that vanilla, the tobacco, and the sweetness of it, man. It's, it'll definitely, and it's, it's like, it's more like a smoky, kind of like a smoky tobacco also. It kind of reminds me a little bit of John Barbatus' Vintage, two guys. If you guys smell John Barbatus Vintage, it reminds me of that too. It's got the same kind of sweetness. It got the same like sweetness, like the same smoky tobacco type smell. And it's kind of, it's syrupy. It's almost like a syrupy sweet. And I, that's what I would say with that one. And uh, But it's a great, it's a great cologne though. It's a great cologne. I highly recommend this one. And in my opinion, the longevity and the projection probably better than John Barbatus Vintage. You know, I would go for this because it's much cheaper. It projects better. The longevity of this is better than John Barbatus Vintage. So if you like John Barbatus Vintage, go for this. Either CK1 Shop, but this right here is going to be cheaper. It's just like CK1 shop, just a fraction of the price. Like I said, this lasts in order for 8, 10 hours or longer. Depends on where you put it at on your body. And uh, that sweet, smooth tobacco mixed in with the vanilla, it's, it's just a great scent. And this smells like fall in a bottle, to be honest. It's got more of a Christmas time scent, too, guys. Smell more like Thanksgiving, Christmas. It's got that kind of smell, you know, it gives you that feel of a Christmas time in a baller type scent. Smell a little bit like a, something else smells similar to it. Can't tell exactly what it is right now. It's a great scent though, guys. Alright, I highly recommend it. But those of you like John Barbatus Vintage, go for this one. It's a great scent. CK1 Shop, go for that too. It's another great scent. All right. So, guys, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to comment, <laughs> rate, and subscribe. I want to thank all my viewers and my subscribers for watching my videos. So, guys, in the negative comments, keep them to yourself because we will block you, block you, block you. All right. Guys, got any questions, comment down below. This is a dope cologne. Highly recommend it. And man, I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace out, YouTube. Stay smelling good like I do. Alright? Peace out.